What's up gamers and welcome back to my YouTube channel where today we will continue our playthrough of Beyond Two Souls. If this is your first time joining this series, hop on over to episode 1 so you don't miss out on any of the excitement. Speaking of excitement, the last time we played this, we actually had a pretty big moment happen at the end and I still have my mind blown that we almost lost Aiden. As we jump into this next episode, will I make more questionable choices due to being indecisive or will I help Jody? Let's find out as we dive into episode 3 of Beyond Two Souls. We got some snowmen. Do you want to build a snowman? These roads have quite a bit of snow on them. <laughs> Are they looking for Jody? She is very cold and sore, I think. Shake it off, Jody. Just shake it off. It's fine. You got this. You're strong. <laughs> Can't look around really, so there's gonna be something coming up, I would guess, soon. And I can't run. This place is closed. around back. Oh, uh, who's there? You're my mind. You don't see the girl lying down on the ground? Flashback, maybe? Premonition? Hey. It's beginning to think you'd never wake up. Where am I? Well, my place, kid. Not very luxurious, but. It's quiet. Finding the streets a few days ago. We're in pretty bad shape. You've been taking care of me? I 
Come on, somebody had to. I could leave you lying there, dying like a dog in the street. Understand. What's your name? Jody. Welcome back to the land of living, Jody. Nice to have some company every once in a while. Coffee? Strong. Tastes like shit, but hold you up against the cold. Careful, side. You've been on the streets, kid. Uh, a few weeks, something like that. Be about three years for me. I don't know how many times I thought I was gonna snuff it. Let's go completely nuts. But I guess you can get used to anything. Can't even live with nothing. You want to run? Parents, crazy boyfriends, something like that. Mm, that's a lie. My boyfriend was. He was gonna kill me. So I just had to get away. That's a pretty you made the right big choice. lie. It's better be on the street than let some guy treat you like his property. You're not wrong there, Stan. You got some place to go. Family. Friends, somebody's missing you. No. Yeah, I guess there is someone, but I don't want to see him now. I'm not like this. You can stay here if you like. I ain't got much to share, but whatever I got's yours. Definitely outside of the cold, which isn't a bad thing. Right off the side of the highway. We got no more food left. We got nothing left to eat. We gotta do something about it. You wanna see how things work around here? Yeah, uh, yeah, I'm coming. Okay. Dumpster diving? Okay, that's not where we get our food, good. That's just where we get, you know, clothing, bedding, the works. I'm sure it's fine. We need to make about five dollars, and that's for something hot. I right, would we'll try here. Hopefully, the cold will make people feel more generous. Or the fact that I'm a kid. I'm so cold. How long does it take to hit five dollars? Well, it all depends on people's good grace. Take a couple hours. Take a week. I'm starving. Gonna have to hold on till we get some cash. Think about something else.
Yeah, Stan. I don't think it makes sense both of us being in the same place. I'm gonna go try it over there. Good luck, kid. He's just trying to help you. Across the street. Sub's pizza. It's just fuel. It's so hard. I'm sorry, are you complaining about what food you want to eat? And I told him if he didn't like it, he could leave. Across the street. There's him right. Hey, baby. You looking for a few extra dollars? Maybe I can help you out. That's creepy. I'm hungry. Do you... Do you have anything? Anything at all? Beat it. No bums in here. Supposed to be looking at the shops or Can I sit down outside? I'd probably get yelled at for that, huh? Just judging me by what I wear, huh? Okay. I don't like that this guy just called me baby. So run down. Hey, last time I was get five dollars worth I don't think we did do I have to talk to this dude easy money sugar don't want just to. for your sweet lips that's so gross take the guitar. I mean, we could go see what what's going on over here, but Is that your guitar? Yep. Just about froze my fingers off trying to play it before. Do you want to try? Be my guest. Can she play? I can't remember.
leave you here. Oh, are you gonna make people feel bad for us and get some money? Wearing your wounds. Bad songs do that. Waving your guns are somebody new. Oh, baby. dark all of a sudden. Wow. Did we get enough? somebody out we've got enough let's go see how Stan's doing how's it going not great you holy sh Jody, where did you get all that cash? I found it. There was a guy with a guitar, and I, I play guitar. I mean, I well, I made it. I made a few bucks. Oh wow, that's something. That's really something. Stay right here. I'm gonna go get us some food. I really hope he doesn't screw us over. <laughs> I don't think he's going to, but... Ooh, what you got there, old fella? Looky here. You win the lottery, lucky son of a bitch. I don't want any trouble. Trouble? Trouble? That is disrespectful. Oh, fuck. Come on, Jody. Did you see that? How the asshole kind of just folded right up. Back off and you won't get hurt. Looky here. It's like Bum's got a girlfriend. Rolling it. Let's demonstrate how we deal with skanky low life. Got a little cocky for your britches, huh? Oh, I went the wrong way. Oops. I always mess up with these. I get cocky, and then they get cocky, and then it's a back and forth, back and forth. Oh, I need to go towards it. You go towards it. Nope, that was supposed to be away from it. Shit. Dodge it. There we go. Hit him. Dodge. This bitch is crazy. See you later, bitch. I'm out of here. How did you do that? I learned how to fight in the army. Yeah, but there was four of them. Is one of you? Four assholes. They did not know how to fight. <laughs> Let's get out of here before they come back. I mean, I definitely took some hits because right. I messed up, but... <sighs> the fights confuse me because sometimes you have to dodge them and sometimes you have to go into them because it's a hit. It... Still figuring out the mechanics.
Jody. Hi guys. Don't get it. Come on, Jody. Help yourself. Hey, we can get a bit of chocolate for dessert. Ooh. Chocolate? I don't reckon I even remember what that tastes like. <laughs> what happened to you, Stan? They got in a fight. If it wasn't for Jody, I'd still be lying there. Should have seen it. There were four guys. Jody kicked herself some ass. <laughs> um, let's talk about the attackers. Did you know those guys? Yeah, I've seen them before. You know, those kids come down here looking for a one-way fight. We got them phones with the cameras, and oh, I guess they like to show off. <laughs> Men with their friends. Crazy motherfuckers. <laughs> they got me once. Still haven't recovered. But that's about Walter. Walter? How did you end up here? Uh, I was a high school teacher. Till I stopped being able to pay back the loans. And lost my house, my job, all my friends. Ended up here on dead end drive. about you, Jimmy? Jimmy? Are, are you okay? Oh, no. I'm cold. I'm so fucking cold. Drugs. How long have you been here? I found the bridge about, I don't know, six months ago. Up to the Walter. Jimmy showed up. Susie's been here, what, like three weeks? How about you, Jody? You haven't said much about yourself. How did you end up on the street? Did some things that I'm not proud of. <laughs> Until I realized I was being used. I, I know that this is gonna sound really strange, but I'm, I'm different. It's made my whole life a fucking mess. You said you were different, Jody. In what way? Mm. We're gonna be sincere. Ever since I was born, I've been linked to an entity. His name is Aiden, and he's always with me. He's here right now. Looks like Jimmy isn't the only one with a drug problem. <laughs> we were being serious, but you could think it's drugs. Poor Jimmy. Should we ask He's her about really baby? Shape. When when is your baby due? Next month. She hasn't been kicking for days. Oh no. My boyfriend. He didn't want a baby. So he beat the crap out of me. And now. I'm really worried. I hope the baby's okay. What are you doing? Trust me.
Doctor, that's not funny. It's been a long time, Stan. Four long years. Liz? Liz? Liz, it can't be you. It is me, my love. I never left. I've been here beside you all this time. That's creepy. Oh my God. Breaks my heart to see you so lost, so desperate. It's hard, Lizzie. It's so hard. I'm empty without you, my love. I'm so empty. Stop living in the past, Stan. Nothing's gonna change what we had together. But now you have to start a new life. Go back to work. Fall in love, just be happy, and for me, Stan, do it for me. God, I miss you. God help me, I miss you. Oh. Is that what we intended to do? It's a miracle. Goddamn miracle. I guess so. Jody? Thanks. He's trying to do good. We need an ambulance. We need a whole goddamn hospital. No, no, no hospital. Ah! They'll, they'll take my baby. No, no one's going to take my baby. Jesus Christ, girl. We ain't got nothing here. Ain't got as much as a blanket, hot water. We got nothing. My baby. Oh, I don't want my baby to die. Whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, calm down. Calm down. Find a way. All right. All right, Jimmy. Down the road away, just sold abandoned building. Figure out a way inside. On my way. Go. Both of you sit through and stay here with Tuesday, okay? Jody, come on. We gotta go get everything we need. Now, you girl, don't be having no baby till we get back, all right? I am trying, but you better damn well hurry! Oh. Are we really gonna help them give birth? Let me run. I just have to do? follow what the game lets me do. Do you know a doctor? No. Besides, we don't have any money to pay for it anyway. So what are we gonna do? Listen. Oh no. I just maybe have a chance. You have a tiny little chance in this big fucked up world. I want it to be warm and have a diapers and a bottle and decent clothes like any other human being. I won't let it be born in the trash under the bridge. I won't. Okay. So what's your plan? I don't have one. But we'll figure it out. Come on. Are we about to break into the supermarket? Using uh, there's Aiden. all we need in there. We just gotta get in. God damn it! There must be a way. There must be a fucking way. Leave it to me. Huh? Why? What are you gonna do? Just trust me. Door. 
must be a switch for the security gate somewhere. This right here? Is that the switch? Yeah, that is the switch, okay. How the hell did you do that? No time to explain. Let's just take what we need and get out of here. You're not gonna go in and help? I took everything I could. Okay, you grabbed a bag here. too? Oh, there you are. Hurry, her water broke. Get into the building I told you about? Yeah, yeah, Walter's there with her. Come on, we need to hurry! I feel like if we just broke into that and he put everything in a bag, we should have been able to grab more and put it in another bag so that we would be good for a couple days. We already broke in at this point. We already com committed a felon. So, like, let's make it worth it at least. So these footprints in the snow are gonna give them exactly where we are if anybody comes looking for us. Just in time, guys. Seems like it's gonna be any minute now. Now what? Anybody know what to do? Leave! All of you. Except Jody. I just want Jody. I don't know how to help somebody give birth, though. You, you, you know that I, I've never done anything like this before. Oh, well, me neither. I just didn't want those guys standing around staring at me when I'm wrecked in pain. Ah! Okay. Okay, don't worry. Don't worry, we're gonna figure this out. We're gonna figure this out. I mean, how hard can it be? Ah! 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 Enough where people have to go to school for it. Let me just help you get those off. Anything else I can find for her, maybe? I'll okay. just clean up this old mattress. Come for her. Hang in there. Okay, you can do it. Quickly, let's just put it out there. I'm doing fine. Okay, you're doing just fine. Uh, I can see it. Uh, I can see the head. I can see the head. Just push. Push. Something's not right. the 
Cody. <laughs> Babe. Like, I hope nothing wrong goes. Like, super anxious. I'm stumbling over my words. That's how anxious I am. He had plenty of blankets, though. Can we at least cover her up? So she's a little bit more comfortable. Also, placenta. Just don't forget about the placenta. It's not been easy so far, babe. But we're we gonna make it. Me and you. Get the others. Okay, they did at least cover her up. Perfect. Wow. It's so tiny. It's yep. a girl. Her name's Zoe. Shit, man. She's goddamn amazing. Hey, watch your language, Walter. She understands everything you say. She's more than amazing. She's magnificent. I couldn't have done it without you guys. And Jody. Okay, that was a cute moment. You're married to Jody. Oh, I'm married. really sweet. I was so nervous. Sam, wake up! What the? Oh, God. Where are the others? Walter's on this floor, Jimmy, and Tuesday and Zoe are upstairs. Get out of here, I'll go get them. No, 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 I'll come with you. No, no, I'm going alone. Oh. I said get out of here! and the baby. They're upstairs. We gotta save them before the whole place burns down. Go, 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 go. A little bit more pep in your step, Jody. Let's go. <laughs> but it was those little fucking punks that I kicked their ass.
to do? Jody, what are you doing? Keep going! I forgot how to switch to Aiden. Doing this. Jody! Definitely uh, lost Jimmy. Because I forgot how to switch to Aiden. messed up. How you doing today, Jody? Good? Okay. We're gonna put this on you. Remember? It's just like a crown. I said no. End of story. You're risking your breath. Yeah. Uh, so I'm a hundred thousand now. You're you can get warm. warm. And I have a diapers and a bottle. You'll never be like that. You need to get warm. You're married, Jody. Not that that I know. Not that 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 the entity. Is but from the depths of the earth. I'll get the beer. Guys, do the shutters. Study the other side. We need to the gold. Jody, if you don't want to do it, just say, and I'll take you back. The entities. Gotta get closer. <laughs> Who 
is that woman? Um, Why are you showing me this? Is she, is she my mother? Was Jody adopted? Why is she all hooked up? Why does she have... Does she have to get head surgery? Or uh, brain surgery? Because I saw a scar on the back of her head. Why did I do this? I didn't want to come back. Look over here. I want to see what we have in this room. Saw a picture on the side of our table here. The bastards got picked up the night they set fire to a building. Gasoline on the clothes gave them away. You believe that? Assholes. So it was the guys that we kicked their ass off. Like, <gasps> they did start the fire. This is us, Jody. Together. Were we in a coma? This way we will always be by your side. <laughs> and I don't think we saved Jimmy, unfortunately, because, like I said earlier, I forgot to how to switch from I uh, from Jody to Aiden. How long was she in a coma for? Come on, let me pick up that next one. Oh. Some of the angles are interesting. Can I get that picture frame, please? No? There we go. <gasps> the baby! Sylvia's so three months old today. I often tell her about you so that she knows what you did for her. Oh, and I started using my real name again. It's Eliza. So at least three months we were in a coma. Yeah, that's her. Concussions and skull fractures. She's been in a coma for several months. Oh, Can see her? no. Are you family? I'm with the CIA. This girl is wanted for treason. So not true. you have an arrest warrant if that's what you need. Not true. Fake news. I did nothing. Okay. I am innocent until proven guilty. Well.
doesn't seem like a good idea with how high up we are, but it's fine. Um. Um. So, where is she? Oh, that's weird. This is a room. She should be here. Shit. She went out the window. Oh, that's impossible. We're on the fifth floor. She couldn't go out the window. Call it in. That girl cannot get away. Okay, she did go out the window five stories up, and she's got clothes now. Uh-oh. Wait. Ma'am? Is everything all right? Is this the police officer from the beginning? The one that helped her? I'm circling around! Wow. Wow is legit all that I can say. I did not expect us to go from a very intense episode last time right back into another freaking heart jerker. There was so much that happened. We helped Tuesday um, give birth. We met Stan. We met the rest of the homeless people. They're all super awesome. We became family. Um, clearly, we got into the fight with the thugs, and the thugs wanted to come back at us and burnt the place that we were staying down. Unfortunately, we did not save Jimmy because I couldn't remember how to switch from Jody to Aiden, and uh, we didn't make it out, so we've been in a coma for the last three months. I'm sure everything's going to be perfectly fine. If you guys have enjoyed this series so far, don't forget to give it a big old thumbs up, as well as hit that subscription button, ding that notification bell so you get alerted when my next video goes live. And if you guys have a spare moment, don't forget to drop your thoughts in the comments so I can know what you guys are thinking, what you expected, what you want to see in the future of this series. And uh, until next time, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and thanks for tuning in. Bye!